you better be thinking mobile first. With website design, you better be thinking mobile first with photography, content, how is your social media, you know, 60 yeah. something percent of our time online now is in social media. So how are you using this to better your brand and your connection? You have to first look, well, what does that look like on the mobile phone? On a phone, on a four and a half, five inch screen, not, yeah. not a 27 inch yeah. desktop anymore. Yeah. You as the executive and business owner, you may be still looking at the desktop, but I got to tell you something, you're not your customer. That's, that's right. not the way they experience the world. It's not the way they're going to experience your product or your service. Yeah, it's right back to audience speak. Yeah. What is the people you're trying to target doing? How are they interacting with your brand? How are they interacting with life, which now now, we interact with life right here now. Yeah. We don't just we don't just come to a mall anymore yeah. and and hang out. Yeah. We've got to do we've got to show on Instagram. We got to check in. We got we got to do all this stuff. And that's the screen between life we're now seeing. So here's some questions for you as a business owner. If you're wondering what those kids downstairs are doing with your brand and social media and all, well, first off, uh, and the developers because you don't speak their language. But here's some simple things that will equip you to ask the right questions. One. Uh, is it mobile first? Yeah. Go, go look at your own website on the phone. Does it stack up? Does everything look right to you on the phone? Secondly, I got another one. Call your customer service department and see how it works. Yeah, yeah. So on the phone, can I touch the phone number and and call your office? Can I touch the address and yep. it takes Get me the a, map. immediately yep. to map? You'd be surprised how much this is not going on. Another question I ask them is that. Um, developers, are we on AMP? Are we amped, amped up? Well, what does that mean? That means accelerated mobile pages. Everything online, these, yes, everything online these days is about pleasing Google, kissing up to Google. And as much as you may dislike that, it's they the way it is. So they're big on a thing called AMP. And what this means is there's a code put on every one of the pages of your website that's going to mean they load on the phone, they load mobile much, much faster. Why is that important? Well, it's because you want to please Google. And you know that somewhere down the line, if I haven't done that, well, and my competitor has, they may have an advantage of us. Well, and again, people yeah. aren't experiencing who you yeah. are, what you're about, or yeah. anything about you on a desktop anymore. Right. In that scenario where I asked Robert for a recommendation, guess what Brad's going to do the minute after Robert says, call Bob right. Jones or whatever? Yeah. I'm going to go look up Bob Jones right yeah. there. It's yeah. right here now. Mm -hmm. Everything is right here that I need. And so, so so you go there, and what if it just takes forever to load? The pages are not coming up and all. Well, you as the business owner executive, hey, we're going to give you a tip down in the bottom of the notes here of how you can go check up on the developers and they're doing a job. There's a page speed test. It's available to all developers. Obviously, there's a lot not using it. Yeah. But it's going to tell you, it's going to rate your website, the mobile experience and the speed because Google is measuring how fast your page opens in milliseconds. It's a race. But what it is about is that do you want to frustrate your customer? You know, it's almost be the equivalent of... You may not even be a customer. Yeah, you're a prospect. I mean, I'd be a, be a customer. It's yet. like leaving someone on hold when you call. Mm -hmm. Yep. It's That is the way it yeah, is. They're stuck. That's our Clarity Clip of the Week. We'll see you here in the next couple of weeks.